So I have the switch plate cover. It doesn't quite want to fit. It's hitting the trim right over here. So what you want to do first is mark it. Then grab a speed square and reference your mark all the way across the switch plate cover. Now we're going to take this belt sander and grind down to our mark, being careful not to go past our mark. And it's better to leave a little bit extra, go do a test fit, and then come back and take off a little more if you need to. And you just kind of grab, remove the burrs of the plastic. And you want to be careful not to press too hard when you're doing this. You want to press kind of lightly and just work it back and forth. Because if you press too hard, it, it can actually catch and kind of flick back. And you don't want to do that. So just remember to press lightly and try to keep your plate under control. So as you can see, I got a nice clean edge. So let's go give it a test fit. Looks like it'll fit, I just need to adjust the outlets a little bit. So let's say your gap here is a little bit big. What you can do is actually loosen these and slide everything over a little bit to get it nice and tight. So that's what I'm gonna do. All right, and there's the final product. You see we got a pretty good fit up here. Little, little bit of a gap down there. Not a big deal. I could take off this plate and then adjust the switches later to maybe get it to line up a little better. I'll do that later off camera. I also had a few other locations that I had to do in this house that I'll show you real quick. So I did this switch right here. I had to take some off the bottom. And I did this switch right here. I had to take some off the side. Well, that's it for this video. And as always, if you found this helpful, please hit the like button and subscribe, and I'll catch you guys next time.